We just did the uh, <laughs> blood and honey. It's pretty grainy, not sweet whatsoever, really. Kind of cheap tasting. Dry. Very dry. Well, there's another one that I got while I was in Texas. I've had a little bit of bad strain. Hopefully this will have some more flavor. Brewed in Texas. Get down with the clown. Rodeo Clown Double IPA. Hopefully this will have some flavor. It is Carboch. What did you say that? Carboch? Carboch. Carboch Brewing Company. Let's see if it says the word or other. Uh, Houston, Texas. It is an IPA. Double IPA. Oh, double IPA. So I was hoping we get some flavor. I think I pour too much in mine. Fuck yeah. Mm, that smells very piney. Piney slash multi. Oh yeah. You've got a nice dark brown, bronzed, copper. Kind of a copper, bronze, kind of clear color. It smells like this one actually might not be bad. Let's give her a whack. Wow. You got a bitter bite. Dry finish. Easy drink. Good sweetness to keep you keep you interested in it. Not dry. Right. Just slightly. I mean, the pizza beer, in my opinion. Good with pizza. Good with pasta. Some pizza, spaghetti, pizzini. Mm. Anything with a lot of olive oil in it. <clears throat> mm. It's a little dry on the very end, but it, 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 it takes a little bit to kick in. And in between that time, 20 seconds, you got your fat ass better have a, a bite of pizza, a bite, a bite of pasta, a bite of teddy, a bite of something. If you're ever so inclined, a bite of penis, whatever you're into. Flavor-wise, I mean, pretty good. I mean, balances back and forth, keeps it interesting. From your sweet to your bitter, to a dry finish. I'm dying. I like herpes. I don't know that, that douchebag is. What do you do to like? Heart? Okay. I liked it. Women. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> You're double clicking everything on the goddamn page. <laughs> fucking stakes and buttholes and fucking. <laughs> Nothing's even happening. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Share a picture? Heavy. He's a good dude. He's from Canada. Oh, heavy. I thought he said heavy. Yeah, get back to the beer. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, we're, we're on camera. I'm, I'm learning new technology. Damn. It's still interesting. Good beer. Yeah. It's got all that mixture of the sweet to the bitter to. A little bit dry. Just enough to keep you wanting to keep coming. <laughs> oh. Killing too much time here. <laughs> I mean, 
Double IPA is not bad at all. Good easy drink. Good citrus. Yeah. Good pineapple esque kind of a uh, grapefruit. A little too much on the dryness for me, but not too bad. Not enough to destroy the beer. No. Getting a little, a little bit of phlegm. If you chose that, you did. I did. I did. Good on spin. Uh, I'm about to toss it. That. Double IPA, not bad. Mm -hmm. Give it a seven. I said eight and a half. Uh, if it had been a little too, little more on the phlegm side, it'd have to be a lot lower. Dry just kind of hit me a little off. Yeah, too dry for me. <laughs> Getting good citrus though. Yeah, it's got good citrus flavor. A little mix of the sweet and bitter. So, so there you go. I got about a seven and a half overall. I think a little better than that. But we're. Let's just go ahead and say eight overall. Muzzle. Well. Fuck. You're good. Where's it there? Shit. Where's it at? Oh, it's on there. You carried it over there reading it. Yeah. On the phone. There you go. It's road, Rodeo Clown Double IPA. Out in Texas. At, I hope you can fucking see that shit. I remember right. Austin, Texas. And there you go. We'll be seeing you.